It's a different scene, you know? It's like, it's like scouting, but it's a different scouting. You know? People are still pretty open, though. But they, yeah, they people, like people are totally open. Yeah. Like, we can, feel, we can feel as bad as we want and like, get better, but it's still not a catastrophe in terms of people liking us. Really good thing, but I just overplay, like, I get... Sometimes you, you're right on there, but you just kind of tighten it up a little bit. But it sounds it sounds so good in the song. It's like when, it's, when that breaks out, it's just like, this is great. I don't have to play anything more. I was like, what's Dave doing in the hi-hat? I was like, it's like oh, shaker. It's like, hi. Right. You know, Dave's taking the naps. So yeah, well, I'll tell you, I definitely, partially my fault. Like, I think I'm getting too, too bad, you know. Mm -hmm. Fucked up a lot. Play with shit. Really? If you read. Rewind the tape, you look at you'll notice that it makes playing my shitty my shitty playing caused the rewind. But it was cool. That's cool. Uh, seems like you guys got cut a little short. Yeah, I guess so. They're running late, I guess. I don't care. The way I figure it, you know, shitty playing, a short set, anything that happens can be uh, overcome by having a good show. Yeah. That seemed like you know, just uh, the whole show as a whole was pretty cool. It's fun to dance to and all that, you know? Yeah, the kids seem to do it. I hope so. That's all that matters. I, I hope that uh, that cute girl dug it too. I put her out to you, didn't I? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Maybe I'll ask her to dance. You can film us. Actually, I think she left. I didn't see her during our show. It's like 50% of the places are cool. And 50% of the places are like, we didn't know you were going to be here. Right. And it's like, I'm not going to like bust my ass loading my shit in and spin for like 20 minutes in between the sets while there's like a sound check. Oh, so you know, you should be, you should be spinning every show. Right, well, right. well particularly, but, but also like, the thing is like, I'm like a bill where there's like four bands, like this, this, this. this. I spin for like 20 minutes in between, and like, the second 10 minutes of that is sound Oh, not those, I don't play it. Hey! Fascinating. Now, how much do you want to flip it? Well, maybe we should just go like this. The little person on each corner. How hard is that? How hard is that? Sound you excited about the big radio show today, Isaac? No. Right. Okay. Cool. Sing the chorus, Peter. What is it? Uh, my name's Casey Phillips. I do a, a show called The Scott Parade. I've been on almost seven years. I've had over 130 live performances. I've had five hit songs stem from my little old program, all the, it seems to be a beam of light. How about the Scholars? Have you heard a lot about them? Isaac Green and the Scholars? Yeah. Oh, of course. I've known Isaac Green. We, we chatted on the internet. And it's, it's sort of nice to actually see the bands who have been, you know, touring around, not making any money, you know, just doing it for the sheer love of it, um, actually be able to keep their artistic integrity at the highest level and be able to pay their rent at the same time. And and also the other thing is a lot of the musicians and bands don't want to play in their closet their whole lives, man. They don't want to be closet musicians. They want to get their music out to as many people as possible. But the, the thing is, as long as that they're able to, to you know, as long as they aren't, do, are chain, aren't changing their music to make money. It's like if you're able to keep your artistic integrity and able to make money, that's cool. But if you're if you're changing it to make money, that's not cool in my in my book. And in fact, there's a couple of ska bands out there today. I won't name it names, but uh, who I just I just can't dig. I think I think basically what you do is just concentrate a lot on the songs we play them, and also to realize you're not to be egotistical, but we're really like the best ska band there is. 
you know? Yes! And then she really Hands in the middle! Oh! <laughs> oh, seriously, like, really should remember that. Dumb. And, uh, <laughs> okay, dumb. I think we're gonna play. Oh, wait, oh, real quick. Awesome. Hey, everybody, stop. Everybody, I'm a dumb ass man. Stop. Who's your ass? Who's your Who made you a don't count? Who made you a don't count? No, don't count. No. 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 And now, live and direct once again. All the way from St. Louis, Isaac Green and the Scholars live and direct on this edition of the Scott Parade. Get on the mic, get on the mic. I... Thank you. <laughs> By person, okay, we got Ethan Dircole on guitar, David Woo! Sharma on drums, Willie Horton, that's his real name on bass, David <laughs> Rody plays the Hammond, Evan Shaw plays trombone and hey, that's, sings. That's an alien. Come on. <laughs> Jessica <laughs> Bowman plays really alto and sings very, very well. <laughs> and gonna... Isaac, what do you do? I don't think I'm so shouts. I don't, do... I don't know what I do. Shouts. <laughs> Anyhow, we got, we got a few more. By the way, we have seat. Oh, wait a second. We're not on stage. Anyhow. <laughs> Oh, we're gonna move on. <laughs> 